Hello there guys, it's Joel here, aka Galax, and welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today for a new sneaker unboxing, this little pink baby beside me. Um, if you are accustomed to the brand Acne Studios, you will already know that this is their signature packaging. If you are new to the channel and you haven't yet subscribed, don't forget to click that subscribe button. If you're not getting notifications and you've been subscribed for ages, then unsubscribe, resubscribe, and click the bell again for notifications just to like rejig your whole system. So yeah, I was on the fence about these for quite some time. I noticed a couple of guys rocking them on Instagram. Um, people that I remember wearing these are um, Jake from Jake Taze. I will leave a link to his Instagram down below. And George from Represent Clothing, both rocking the Rockaways. Um, and I've seen them. I've seen them pop up a few times on different stores, and I was like, oh, they are sick. Um, but I was obviously a massive Triple S fanboy, and you could not stop me wearing my Triple S. I've seen them so much that I've, they've grown on me. Some people really, really hate these as well because um, I like to play when I get a shoe out. Also, <laughs> in my, my last video was a sneaker unboxing as well because I have a lab, a collab coming on Sunday um, with someone who I've never done a video with before so it should be really exciting to just check that out on Sunday. I've lost what I was saying now. What was I saying? Um, oh yeah, in my last video, my Converse J.D. Anderson unboxing, and in all my shoe unboxing, people literally get so annoyed because they're like, obviously they're watching this video to see me open these shoes, um, and that's kind of all they want to see. And yeah, I love it when people leave comments with the timestamp of like the moment that I open the box. Um, so whoever gets the timestamp first correct in this, you're a winner, baby. Drag Race reference, if you didn't know. These were kindly sent to me by the guys over at Forward. Um, I've shopped at Forward for years. Um, it, is an, it is an awesome store, they have an excellent buy. Um, they stock a lot of cool designers and they get some of the best pieces from those collections too. So I've left a link to these sneakers from Forward in the description box below. You should just check out Forward anyway if you haven't already. Is this the time? When is the time? Is this? Or is it when I get the shoe out? Or if I put it back in? I'm just messing with you. Um, also wearing my, I got my bare knuckles cargo pants delivered. Um, and, but this is just one, these are just one piece. Because I got these from Macus. Is that how you say it? Macus? Machus? Macus? Jacob, I'm sorry. I got these from Macus. And um, the rest of my bare knuckles stuff is coming from bare knuckles themselves. Um, which has been shipped out, so it should arrive soon. Let me know if you want a whole Bare Knuckles video because I am super stoked about these and I'm pretty excited for the rest of the stuff as well. So I'm still fucking with y'all when I'm gonna open this box. Um, so yeah, these are the Rockaway sneakers. They are Acne Studios version of the Chunky Dad sneaker. So here they are. Acne Studios is a brand from Stockholm. Basically coined a whole aesthetic, Scandinavian, minimalist, very effortless kind of style. And um, they've been going since 1996, I think. Their footwear isn't always my favorite. Like I like their um, ready to wear pieces a lot more and their denim. But these, um, yeah, have grown on me so, so. I do them in loads of different colorways as well. Some stores have their own like limited edition styles too, um, but I went for the kind of gum and white and gray pair. But you do, Forward have got another pair that just came in that are black and white, which looks so sick too. Um, but I didn't really have a kind of gum sold pair of sneakers, so I thought I would go for this, for these ones. I got them in a 43, like UK9, and they are a little bit big, so maybe you could afford to go down. I just always suggest trying them on in store because everyone's feet are different. So they're quite a complex design as well, like quite intricate. So you've got the, obviously the sole, and um, you've kind of got the cold chunky dad vibe at the back, but then it kind of splits halfway and goes to this kind of like, bubble, this kind of bubbled braille type texture around the front. And then on the bottom you have the kind of gum sole which is going all down. And um, coming up to the upper it's all leather and suede with like various panelling and different kind of shapes. You've got the pull tab at the back and then you kind of have like an inner sock. So this has got a grey colourway inside for the tongue and then like an inner ankle support at the back. It is all very nicely cushioned, these are insanely comfortable and they are nowhere near as heavy as any other chunky sneaker that I've been wearing. Again, you've got kind of like a, I'm going to say braille, I'm not trying to offend anyone, it's just that's what it feels like. Um, we've got a braille bit on the tongue. Um, and then the laces themselves are quite like ribbon-esque, I feel, because they're quite flat and wide. <laughs>
I've been wearing these with my new Isimiraki on plisse trousers, kind of draped over the top of them, and they're just nice and chunky and they've just got a nice shape that kind of lifts you off the ground. And yeah, I just think they're, they're really sick. Yeah, I think when they first came out, I was like, I'm not such a big fan of these, but it's been what, like, I've been exposed to them for a while now, and I'm like, you know what? I actually really like these. So your opinion can be changed, just like how I don't like Balenciaga speedrunners anymore. I now like Acne Studio Rockaways. Um, I'd love to know your thoughts and opinion on these sneakers as well. Um, so do let me know in the comment section below. I hope you've enjoyed this kind of sneaker unboxing and what are the kind of videos you want to see in the future. And thanks for watching. <laughs> thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe. I'll see you in the next one. Bye guys.